Hello boys and girls and welcome back to story time. Today we're reading a story that was one of my favorite books when I was a little girl and it's called There's an Alligator Under My Bed. This story is written and illustrated. That means this is the person who wrote the story and also drew the pictures by Mercer Mayer. And I'm so excited to read this story with you. There used to be an alligator under my bed. When it was time to go to sleep, I had to be very careful because I knew he was there. But whenever I looked, he hid or something. So I call mom and dad. Do you guys do that when you get scared? You're like, mom, dad, come help. I still do. But they never saw it. It was up to me. I just had to do something about that alligator. So I went to the kitchen to get some alligator bait. I filled a paper bag full of things alligators like to eat. What kind of food do you see on that page? I see some grapes, some bananas, an orange, looks like a box of something. Do you think that's what alligators like to eat? <gasps> I don't know, let's see. I put a peanut butter sandwich, some fruit, and the last piece of pie in the garage. I put cookies down the hall. I left fresh vegetables on the stairs. I put a soda and some candy next to my bed. Then I watched and waited. Sure enough, out he came to get something to eat. Oh my goodness, look at that, he's eating the soda bottle. That's crazy. Then I hid in the closet. I followed him down the stairs. I followed him down the hall. Oh my goodness, his plan is working. When he crawled into the garage, I slammed the door and locked it. Then I went to bed. There wasn't even a mess to clean up. Now that there is an alligator in the garage, I wonder if my dad will have any trouble getting to his car in the morning. I'll just leave him a note. Let's read what that note says. Dear dad, there is an alligator in the garage. If you need help, wake me up. Warning, be careful. Well, I hope that you enjoyed this book as much as I did and I'm so excited to be back soon to read another story with you. Have a good day, bye. 